So for today, we're going to be looking at 801. We're going to be looking at the shaders that she's offering for this week. I really should have done this last week, but I just kind of, it kind of hit me like now, like, oh, I should make videos on this because there's a lot of shaders that people don't have that Ada is offering. And specifically for me, there is one that she was offering that I didn't have. So if you guys like the video, like, comment, subscribe. I was thinking about combining this with the challenges slash Eververse video, but I want the shaders to really be the focus of the video because some of these are really, really good. So that's why we're going to be doing it separately. So again, if you guys like the video, I appreciate you guys liking something because it really does help the channel because a lot of people that come to my channel are actually not subscribed. So again, I appreciate it and let's get into it. So the first one's going to be Shadow Guilt. This is a really good shader, a like a really good distressed black and gold. The gold is not distressed, but the black and pretty much everything else is. The purple is also not distressed, but everything else really is. To be fair, everything else is just the black color. So as you guys can see from the armor, you guys will see a lot of distressed color. The gold is like very pristine. So if you can get the gold, that's really good. I'll have it. I'll have how it looks with cloth right now, just because I don't want to switch out my armor. So that because I have to do this for three shaders. And again, this is not like a shader in depth view. Although if you guys would like me to do that, feel free to comment in the comments. So that way I can see it and I could get started on that. But this is just more sh to showcase the shaders. But Overall, I really like this shader. I have used this shader in one of my builds for my Warlocks, which if I have time, I'll show how she looks right now. But yeah, definitely a dope shader that you should definitely pick up considering this is from Season of Man of the Menagerie. And that was pre, pre, uh, what is it? Shadow, Shadow Keep? And that's an old expansion, so I do recommend it. Uh, an even older shader, shader, Kyro's Black. This is a really cool shader. I think my only gripe with it is the green plate and like the fact that the edges are kind of distressed. I like the shader a lot because of the teal color, but that's where it really ends. How it looks in cloth, I'll show you guys right now. Again, I think this shader is super dope. Um, I think it would be better on Titans, especially if you can get that, like the off color for the teal. So that way the teal is a little bit more pronounced. But yeah, definitely a cool shader. I wish I really liked it more so I could wear it. And then last but not least, new monarch, new monarchy regalia. This is a dope shader. This is the Iron Man shader. So if you guys have missed out on this one, like I have, then definitely pick it up. The reason I missed out on it is because I started a month before Forsaken came out and I ended up uh, siding with new monarchy, not new monarchy. I ended up siding with, uh, the the edge lords i forget their name and the uh future war cult so those are the two that i teamed up with and i just unfortunately missed out on a lot of the a lot of the new monarchy stuff which thankfully the shaders are coming back hopefully we get the ornament back in because the ornament is really cool for the titans but that's how it looks on uh cloth armor i'll show you guys right now this is how my hunter looks right now currently well technically uh yeah, the shader super dope. I can talk about the shader for hours. Uh, I love the red. I think it's just such an amazing red and gold shader, and it's really cool because like it get like the the shade the color of the shader uh, specifically for the for the uh, cloth armor almost reminds me of the the color for actually well, that's it for the shaders. I can just show you what I mean. So I, this is how my hunter currently looks, but I had changed it, but I switched out my build again. Um, it reminds me of these type of colors like this one. Where's the other one there is it over here? No, where are you? There's where the, f oh, here it is. So like something like this, it kind of reminds me of this color, which like, I'm not wrong. It's just so weird. So Titans are Hunter. So yeah, let me know what you guys think about the shaders in the comments below. I'm really excited that the new monarchy regalia is back just because it is such a good shader. And again, highly recommend you guys to pick this one up it's such a good shader so let me know what you guys think be safe and i'll see you guys later